Hey guys, this is Rocket Man Dan. Welcome to the first episode of Quick Guides, where we'll be discussing reaching orbit. Build a ship that has at least 3,600 meters per second and a TWR of 1.6 or higher. You could try and copy this one if you like. Tap circle to turn on SAS. Click in L3 to open the cursor, move it down to the bottom left and tap X to open the manoeuvre mode. Move your cursor up to the orange delta V readout and open that also. Don't forget to turn your throttle to full by pressing up on the D-pad. Stage by tapping X and keep your TWR below 1.6 by periodically holding in L1 and tapping down on the D-pad. Now we're going to wait until our velocity reaches 100 meters per second and when it does we're going to tilt over 10 degrees to the right on the nav ball by using the left analog stick. When you've achieved that, lock to prograde by holding in L1 and tapping triangle and selecting prograde. Don't forget to keep an eye on your TWR keeping it just below 1.6. Also, be mindful of your altitude. You want to be at a heading of 45 degrees on the nav ball when you're anywhere between 10 and 15,000 meters above sea level. When you reach 45 degrees, turn on stability assist and hold it at 45 degrees. When your predicted apoapsis reaches 50,000 meters, turn your ship over to 90 degrees on the nav ball and keep it there. Don't forget to stage when necessary. When your predicted apoapsis is above 70,000 meters, you can cut thrust and lock to prograde. Now tap L1 and R1 simultaneously to open the map view. Click in L3 to open the cursor. Tap X on your apoapsis and choose Add Manoeuvre and cycle through with R1. Add Prograde by pushing up the right analog stick until your predicted periapsis is also above 70,000 meters. Tapping in L1 and R1 again will close map view and end the manoeuvre editor. Once you're above 70,000 meters Lock to your manoeuvre node and wait. Your manoeuvre will have a predicted burn time. You need to start your burn half of that time before your node. So if your burn is 10 seconds long, you need to start your burn 5 seconds before that node. Tap up on the D-pad to activate full throttle and complete your manoeuvre. If everything has gone right, you should now be in orbit. Congratulations. Now when it comes time to return back to Kerbin, point your ship retrograde and gently burn until your periapsis is somewhere between 30 and 35,000 meters. Now, point your ship either normal or anti-normal to prevent a collision with the engine when you stage. Before you re-enter the atmosphere, you should point your ship retrograde again.
an important part of a successful mission is returning back safely, so let's hope you remembered the parachutes. You wouldn't be the first Kerbinaut not to. Open your chute when it's safe to do so. Now the Kerbal system is yours to explore. Thanks very much for watching. If you'd like to like, share, subscribe, maybe leave me a comment, that'd be great. See you next time. Bye bye.